Yo, there's a ton of flying stuff dropping this week, a ton of Olympic stuff dropping this week, and some Puma stuff dropping for the ladies. There's just a lot dropping this week. I am your host, Jacques Slade, and this is the Heat Check. <laughs> First up, let's talk Flyknit. There is a ton of Flyknit dropping this week, and most, if not all of it, is part of Nike's Unlimited Potential Olympic pack that has a bit of everything in it. The pure running models include the free run Flyknit for both men and women in this multicolor option, and they'll cost you 130 bucks over at Finish Line. Same goes for the free run Motion, which are a lot brighter on the upper, but still add some pop throughout. Those are $150. Now, keeping with the brighter look, the Nike Zoom All Out, which is a very comfortable shoe, those are dropping for $200 for that full length Zoom. On the workout side, we have the Metcon, which doesn't have the fly knit, but the colors fit right in for your training. Those are gonna cost you $130. And as if those were not enough, Finish Line also has the Nike Lunar Epic Flyknit Low dropping today. These are comfortable. Now, you can grab these for $160. It isn't all about running today, though. Nike Basketball is adding a monotone look to the Hyperdunk 08 Retro that celebrates the Olympic Games back in 08, and you can grab those for $150. And while we're talking about Hyperdunks, the new Flyknit 2016 version is hitting shelves today as well in the Oreo colorway. I've played a bit in these, and that Flyknit upper is very nice. Those will cost you $200. Keeping with basketball, but actually switching to Friday, Under Armour has two things coming up. First is the Curry Lux, which upscales the look and materials on the Curry signature line. Those will cost between 140 and 150, depending on which of the five models you pick up. If you would rather instead rep Old Glory, the USA Curry 2.5 will be available starting on Friday in the navy red and white colorway. You can grab those over at Finish Line for $135. Puma has been killing it with the ladies lately, and for the women that like a nice pair of slides, the Puma Lid Cat Fenty hits shelves on Friday. First strap and all, you can grab those for $80. For the classic types, Reebok is taking us to Rucker Park with a new look at the Reebok question. A flashback to when Iverson actually came to the park and put in work at the EBC. Those will cost you $140. Keeping with b-ball but switching to Saturday, the Nike Kyrie 2 parade drops in the mostly white upper. As most of you know, this is actually the pair that Kyrie wore during the championship parade, and you can grab those for $120. I know that you know that the Olympics start this weekend, and why not rock that free run fly knit metal stand colorway while you watch? Expect to see Nike athletes rocking these on the metal stand for the Olympics, and you can grab a pair as well on Saturday for $130. And finally, the most recognizable sneaker on the show today, the Air Jordan 7 Retro Tinker Alternate. Now, this model is based on one of the drawings that Tinker actually created for MJ to wear during the Olympics back in the 90s, and you can look for those to drop at finish line for $190. As I told you guys, tons of great stuff dropping this weekend, so be sure to hit the links down below if you want to find out more about the fly it, more about the Olympic stuff, the lady stuff, all of it's there. Also, make sure you hit that thumbs up because it definitely helps us out and subscribe if you haven't already. That way you know whenever something awesome happens right here on this channel. I am your host, Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line, and as always, guys, I appreciate you. I'll see you soon. Peace. When you have someone like Jordan at the top of your brand, it's easy to rely on the past. But is the Jordan 31 a play for the future? Let's start with the obvious, the Nike swoosh. The last thoughts, as you can see, the outsole is still white and this is just red. So my thought is that they just painted this red. 